Now we will derive property relations for fan of flow. First, we will consider the effect of fan of flow in stagnation temperature T naught. We know that fan of flow is a flow with friction with negligible heat transfer, and hence we can consider the process as an adiabatic process. And in an adiabatic process, stagnation temperature does not change, and hence in a fan of flow, T naught will remain constant. Next, we will consider static temperature ratio T2 by T1. Now we know stagnation to static temperature ratio, which is T naught by T equals 1 plus gamma minus 1 by 2 m square, and this relation holds for an adiabatic process. Hence, we can write T2 by T1 as T naught by T1 into T2 by T naught. We have multiplied and divided by stagnation temperature T naught. We know T naught by T1 from this equation. It will be 1 plus gamma minus 1 by 2 to m1 square. T naught by T2, which will be 1 plus gamma minus 1 by 2 into m2 square. Next, we will consider static pressure ratio P2 by P1. We know from equation of state P equal rho RT, P2 by P1 will become rho 2 by rho 1 into T2 by T1. We know from equation of continuity that rho 1 u1 equals rho 2 u2 and hence rho 2 by rho 1 will become u1 by u2. Now we multiply and divide this equation by a1 and a2, a1 by a1 into a2 by a2 into t2 by t1. Now we know u by a is Mach number, u1 by a1 will become m1. Similarly, u2 by a2, u2 by a2 will become m2 and speed of sound is a equals under root gamma rt and we can write a1 by a2 under root t1 by t2 into t2 by t1 p2 by p1 will become m1 by m2 into under root t2 by t1 this implies p2 by p1 equals m1 by m2 into 1 plus gamma minus 1 by 2 m1 square divided by 1 plus gamma minus 1 by 2 m2 square to the power 1 by 2. Next we will consider density ratio from equation of state which is P equals rho RT, we know that rho 2 by rho 1 will become P2 by P1 into T2 by T1 to the power minus 1 from P equals rho RT. And we have already derived what is T2 by T1 and what is P2 by P1. So, you can find out what will be rho 2 by rho 1. So, rho 2 by rho 1 will come out to be m1 by m2 into 1 plus gamma minus 1 by 2 m2 square 1 plus gamma minus 1 by 2 into m1 square to the power 1 by 2. So, this is our density ratio rho 2 by rho 1. Next, we will consider stagnation pressure ratio P02 by P01. Now, we have already derived static pressure ratio and we know the relation between stagnation pressure and static pressure. Hence, we can write P02 by P01. We will multiply and divide this equation by P1 and P2, P1 and P2. P2 by P1, we already know 
रेशियो ऑफ टेग्नेशन प्रेशर पी नॉट बाय पी फ्रॉम दिस इक्वेशन Now for the simplification of the calculation, what we do is that we take sonic flow as reference condition. Sonic flow as reference condition. These are property relations which we have just derived. What we do is that we take condition at one as sonic condition, sonic condition, and condition at two we take at Mach number m. Now put m one equals one. And m2 equals m in these property relations, and we will denote sonic flow conditions with superscript star with superscript star. So our property relation will become T2 is T, and T1 will become T star equals. One plus gamma minus one by two, which will become gamma plus one, gamma plus one by two divided by one plus gamma minus one by two. M two is m square. P two by P one will become P two is P. P one is P star equals one by m. M one is one. M two is m. In the bracket, gamma plus one by two divided by one plus gamma minus one by two into m square to the power one by two. Similarly, rho two is rho, rho one is rho star one by m into one plus gamma minus one by two into m square. Because m2 is m divided by gamma plus one by two to the power one by two. Sorry, here is one by two, and p not two is p not p not one is p not star. It will become one by m into inside the bracket one plus gamma minus one by two m square. Divided by gamma plus one by two to the power gamma plus one divided by two into gamma minus one. So we have taken sonic flow as reference condition, and we have denoted it with a superscript star, and we have done this to simplify our calculation. What we do is that. We tabulate these ratios p by p star, p by p star, rho by rho star, and p not by p not star. We tabulate these for different Mach number m. For different Mach number m, we tabulate these ratios, and this table is known as Pano tables.